Okay, now the solution to the question. So you're supposed to find the pressure of gas B if gas A is at atmospheric pressure of 100 kilopascal. Okay, so a common misconception is to think that gas B is at atmospheric pressure simply because the level of liquid for the here over here and here is the same, but actually that's not true. It's because though they have the same liquid level, the liquid that's inside each side is actually different. What you need to do is actually to find the common pressure level. Okay, in this case, the common pressure level is this level. Okay, so this level is at your common pressure. What, what it means is that uh, whatever that's pressing down over at site B and whatever that's pressing down on site A at here is actually the same. So we are supposed to find the pressure at site A. What comprises of site A? You find that it's actually the pressure, atmospheric pressure plus the pressure of the uh, water and the pressure of the mercury. So actually there are three components. Similarly, for pressure at site B, you find that what is the pressure of site B is actually the pressure of the gas over here and the pressure of the oil, okay, which is 13 centimeter. So what you need to do is to equate them on both sides. So, and put in the values, so atmospheric pressure is 100 kilopascal, then this is the pressure created by water, and this is pressure created by mercury. And on the other side is pressure of the gas, which you are supposed to find, and then the pressure of oil. And substitute in the values. So, 5 centimeter is 0 0.05, then 8 centimeter is 0 0.08, and so on and so forth. And put in the respective density of the liquid. Calculate the value and you try to solve for pressure of gas B. Okay, so that's how you can find the solution for this kind of problem. Please subscribe and support my channel. For my other physics video lesson arranged according to topics, please visit my blog at boringphysicsteachers.wordpress.com. You can subscribe to my channel to be informed when I upload new physics video lessons. Thank you.